What's up guys, Mark with Under Pressure. We were looking into getting a Note 20 and uh, after doing all the research, um, the phones have a problem. The camera uh, bezel internally has some sort of like chrome flake coming off and it's sitting on a lens or uh, they don't know exactly what it is but it's on all of the series, the three series of the Note 20 phones. So until they get that solved, I would not spend your uh, $1,200 uh, $1,300 or $1,500 on any of these phones until it's resolved. Why would you want to buy a phone that has little flakes of uh, chrome or dust on the lens when that's the part of the reason why you're buying a phone to begin with? Uh, and as far as um, Samsung is concerned, they uh, not acknowledge that they have an issue, but they haven't acknowledged um, anything to do with uh, resolving the issue. Um, and no, it's not a software update. It's an actual physical issue that they have. They're actually claiming that it's in Asia only, which is a full lie. If you look at the news and dig into it, it's also in the U.S. So it's um, if you want a lot of headaches and a lot of phone calls to Samsung and uh, no refunds, um, then buy the phone. Um, if you don't worry about little shadows and specks in your, uh, in, in your pictures or videos, uh, don't worry about it. But I'm sure there's a reason why you're buying this phone. I mean, that's you want to use the 8K, the 4K, and you want to use the 104 megapixel uh, to show your clients uh, your photos before and after and your videos uh, before and after. Um, you know, that's, and on top of that, it's a $1,500 phone. Okay, and if they can't get it right, then why would you why would you invest in that phone? So that's just my thought. But you know, I wouldn't invest that much money. I mean, even though it's a buy one get one free, I still wouldn't do it right now until they fix the problem. So have a great day. I hope that helps you guys out.